Well, the benefits are many. Fertility and animal health are the biggest cost to animal production and productivity on New Zealand farms. Silesio targets both of these tremendously. For instance, we asked a Waikato dairy farm family to tell us about their experience in using Silesio to lower their somatic cell count. When they achieved their lowered somatic cell count, they were able to achieve the additional financial bonus from their milk supply company, an added bonus of the somatic cell count bonus was achieved in that the supplementation with Silesio on this farm was cost neutral. Improvements in animal health, fertility, empty rates were not costed in in this exercise. Therefore they were added benefits of the use of Silesio. The most exciting effect is fertility. BEC New Zealand recommend the use of Silesio one month prior to calving until the end of pregnancy detection. Firstly, this is to reduce the chance of retained membranes. It takes the cow through to correct cycling, getting in calf and then staying in calf. Silesio has a positive impact on these key components to support the pregnancy and the growing fetus. We expect to see high submission rates. After three weeks mating, often farms achieve 99% submission without hormonal intervention often. We experience low return to service as well. On one farm, we had the not in calf rates drop from 13% to 7% over a 10 week calving spread. This allows for positive management decisions to be made based on production and cows can be done based on these sound criteria rather than empty rate doing their culling for them. This farm is looking to reduce the calving spread from a current 10 week spread to a 9 week spread this season. This will allow for more streamlined operations and overall more days in milk.